people, such as, the people of Mecca, question you concerning the hour, when will it be? Say, knowledge thereof lies only with God, and what do you know, what would, provide you with knowledge thereof? In other words, you do not know it, perhaps the hour is near. God has indeed cursed the disbelievers, He has banished them, from His mercy, and prepared for them a blaze, a violent fire into which they shall be admitted. To abide, their abiding having been foreordained, therein forever. They shall not find any protector, to preserve them from it, or helper, to ward it off from them. And they, namely, those who had been the followers, of the leaders of error, shall say, Our Lord, we obeyed our leaders, red, plural, satatana, or satatana, which is the plural of the plural, and elders, and they led us astray from the way, the path of guidance.
O you who believe, do not behave, towards your prophet, as did those who harmed Moses, when they would say, for example, the only reason he does not wash with us is that he has an inflammation in his testicles, whereat God absolved him of what they alleged. When Moses placed his robe on a rock to go to wash, the rock hurtled away with it until it came to a halt amid a group of men from the children of Israel. As Moses chased it and took his robe to cover himself, they saw that he had no such inflammation, Yudra is an inflammation of the testicle. And he was distinguished in God's sight. An instance of our prophet, S, being subjected to hurt was when, on one occasion, while dividing up the spoils a man said to him, This is a division that I do not want to please God, whereat the prophet, S, became angered and said, May God have mercy upon Moses, for truly he was hurt with worse than this, but endured, reported by al-Bukhari.